Good morning and welcome to St Joseph's Community here in Colwyn Bay, North Wales and welcome to our Oblate Morning Prayer. We're at the weekend now and I'd like, as we begin, to ask a little question before we start. What kind of a uh, form are you in? What kind of attitude have you got for the coming weekend, for today? Are we in a disposition to take on the whole world and sort it out? There is a, a few sayings uh, that might be worth listening to. First of all, the really intelligent people have an attitude of fact-finding, not fault-finding. And uh, those with a bad attitude are like having a flat tire. You can't go anywhere until you change it. So it is in that disposition that we look to reading the scriptures for today. It's Matthew chapter 12. And just to dispose ourselves nicely, we begin by making the sign of the cross. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. And our Gospel this morning is uh, going to examine the attitude of the Pharisees. So we read. Jesus took a walk one Sabbath day through the cornfields. His disciples were hungry and began to pick ears of corn and eat them. The Pharisees noticed it and said to him, Look, your disciples are doing something that is forbidden on the Sabbath. But he said to them, Have you not read what David did when he and his followers were hungry? How he went into the house of God? And how they ate loaves of offerings which neither he or his followers were allowed to eat, but which were for the priests alone? Or again, have you not read in the law that on the Sabbath day the temple priests break the Sabbath without being blamed for it. Now here I tell you, it's something greater than the temple. And if you had not understood the meaning of the words, what I want is mercy, not sacrifice, you would not have condemned the blameless. For the Son of Man is Master of the Sabbath. This is the Gospel of our Lord. Thanks be to God. So you see here the, the, the Pharisees were witness to a wonderful expose of who Jesus was. He is master of the Sabbath. And he, they got a good lecture. What I want is mercy, not sacrifice. How much do you think the Pharisees learnt about that encounter with Jesus? Their attitude was to find fault. They did find fault in their eyes, but they were going nowhere. They had a flat tire because they weren't now to find truth. They were out to enforce their own attitudes. And as we look to scripture, we look to the wisdom of God to make it our own. What is our attitude towards scripture? To make it our own. 
we pray in the collect of the day. Another beautiful prayer. O God, who show the light of your truth to those who go astray, so that they may return to right path, give all who for the faith they possess are anointed Christians the grace to reject what is contrary to the name of Christ and to strive after all that does it honour. We make this prayer through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and forever. Amen. And I hope you have a blessed day and a blessed weekend. And God bless you.